Hello beautiful family, this is Danielle and the channel is Fly Girls Manifesting. On this channel I talk about all things Law of Assumption, I sprinkle a little bit of quantum physics on there, and I talk about personal development, how to live your best life, how to be fly while you're doing it, how to look good, how to feel good, how to have confidence. Today's video, I'm going to be talking about how being delusional works every single time. The reason why being delusional works every single time is because whatever you focus on grows. And no matter what anyone around you is telling you about manifesting or whether you can have something that you truly desire to have, when you have a deep burning desire for something, it never goes away. It's all about fooling yourself. Yes, fooling yourself, tricking the subconscious mind. Giving it new ideas, telling it what to believe, play make believe as if it's only a matter of time. This is mine. I have this. If you want to be rich, start calling yourself a millionaire. Start calling yourself a million. I'm a millionaire. I have plenty of money. I am a millionaire. Say it a thousand times. As a matter of fact, your subconscious mind goes to work with making sure that you get what you desire to have. So I want to talk about repetition. That's the number one thing that I do when it comes to me putting the practice of being delusional. I don't care if you tell me that I can't have it or it seems impossible. I'm going to repeat to myself over and over again that things are always working out of my favor. That when you put your heart, your mind, your spirit, your whole entire focus on something it will come to pass it will become a part of your reality if you operate in a space where your imagination is god your imagination is your true reality then you must know that no matter what your 3d circumstances are telling you you get to have your desires now i want to tell you guys how i was delusional with something i will never forget that i wanted to go to sephora so bad <laughs> I love Sephora and I was like oh my goodness I don't know when I'm gonna be able to get to Sephora because I don't live really close to one but I was like you know I would really love to go to Sephora I have some new things that I want to get new brushes my birthday was around the corner so I was like mm, do I want to order online no I want to actually go into the Sephora store I want to smell everything I want to um sample this is pre you know C19 and I just kept thinking about it all day and I was like, no, something's going to work out in my favor where I'm going to get to go to Sephora. For the entire day, I just kept thinking about Sephora and I was thinking about what I was going to buy, how I was going to get there. Um, I don't drive in New York City, so obviously somebody's going to have to take me there or I'm going to have to Uber it, something. But I just kept thinking about it. Well, lo and behold, one of my friends that I used to work with, she calls me and she goes, yeah, um, and we were talking about some other stuff, but she goes, do you shop at Sephora? And I was like, yeah, I do. Actually, I was just thinking about going to Sephora, but obviously I don't live close to a Sephora. She goes, oh my goodness, I have a gift card. My job was giving out gift cards to um, the winners of some contests, and there was only three winners. They gave us five cards, so obviously, since I'm in charge of the, the contest, I took two for myself. Would you like to go to Sephora with me? So my homegirl picked me up, gave me a $60 Sephora gift card, and this happened within about three or four days. That is the test of being delusional because clearly my mind was focused on one thing. Delusional manifesting to me, and by the way, I mean, I can't really prove this, but I believe that I actually was one of the first people about two or three years ago to actually start making videos on being delusional when you're manifesting because I wanted to make sure that my audience understands that there is nothing in this world that you cannot have. And now that I see that people are embracing the delusions <laughs> of manifesting, what it means is that you don't have any reason to doubt. Mental diets are simply deciding that you're only going to focus on the thoughts that are in alignment with your desires. We need to stop letting our thoughts spiral out of control 
and be able to mentally control what we're thinking about there are times when you know you want to get what you want you're not going to be sitting up here saying oh maybe i'll have it maybe i want no mental diet is literally deciding that i'm not going to for a period of time i did this from 9 a.m to about 6 p.m one day this is many many years ago when i first got into mental diets i did it from 9 a.m to about 6 p.m where I just was conscious of the fact that I was not going to let not one negative thought spiral out of control. And when I tell you me having a mental diet for just one day where no negative thoughts, as soon as you see, get the spiraling, you flip your thoughts into a positive outcome or you, you go into a rampage of love, respect, honor, whatever you got to do to keep yourself from spiraling out of control from those, those negative uh, thoughts. I did that for a day and when I tell you it got me right back on track and within the next coming days, two, three, four days a week, I started to see my reality shift into what I desired to have, what I wanted. I started to become the person that was um, living in the desired reality because I mentally would not let my thoughts wander away from my aligned desire. We're manifesting healing. We are breaking through limiting beliefs about what we can and cannot have. I want to invite you guys to subscribe to the channel because I'm going to be throughout the month doing pop-up lives for healing. I will also be letting you guys know some scheduled lives where it's going to be live coaching. And if you are interested in purchasing um, one of my SP workshops, check the description down below. I always encourage people to invest in yourselves because we all need to be able to know that we are the masters of our universe, of our reality. My life is unfolding in amazing ways. Type that down below. My life is unfolding in amazing ways. My life is unfolding in amazing ways. Breathe it in. Accept it. Breathe it in. All right, so I'm out of here, guys. You guys have a wonderful day. And wherever you are, please take care of yourself. Remember that you are loved. It is not a crime to be delusional. Let's focus on what we want, what we desire, and happy manifesting. Bye!